Hi, dear friends. How are you all doing? Oh, I'm really nervous making the vi this video. It has been quite a long time since I last got myself involved in what was my passion and my job, and I mean crocheting. But over the last few weeks I began flirting with the idea of crocheting once again. So I began with the beginner stitches, obviously, like the single and the double crochet stitch. But in the end I got bored of them. And I found out that I was um, missing quite a lot of the chains and loops when touching. I have to touch every single stitch to, you know, insert the hook, yarn over, pull through, etc, etc. So I looked into an easier crochet technique and uh, to begin a project. And I decided to make a blanket, after all, like this one using the granny on the straight stitch. The granny on the straight stitch is a lot easier because of the chain one space, like this one. See, it has quite a lot of gaps, uh, or chain one spaces. So this allows me to, you know, track the stitches much easier. I made this blanket a few years back and I do not remember the materials that I used. So if you are going to ask me about the yarn and the, the crochet hook and the uh, weight of the yarn and etc, I'm sorry guys, I simply do not remember any of, the, any of these details. But if you want to learn how to crochet the granny on the street stitch, you will find links in the description box below the video to my tutorials, my old tutorials on how to make this stitch. I always wanted to make a black and white blanket using the granny on the street stitch for a queen sized bed. Yeah, so I um, asked mom to get me some black and white skins and she did five blacks and five whites. Uh, my sister just read me the information on the label, so I'll try to translate it. Uh, this is 100% acryl. Uh, I believe it is worsted yarn, 210 meters length, and um, the label says that you should use a 3.5 millimeters European sized crochet hook, but I'm going to use a 5 millimeter one, like this one. She it got stuck in the skin, doesn't matter. But um, I'm using the 5mm European size crochet hook out of this set that I got from eBay. I wanted to sell them to you guys. Yeah, but um, we changed our minds, my sister and I, because uh, it was incredibly expensive to ship them internationally. What the... Seriously, so... We gave up. Um, my sister is going to um, uh, focus the camera on the information on the label, but it is in Romanian, so... Guys, please note that this is not an actual tutorial. I'm not going to teach you how to crochet that. Um, cranny on the straight stitch, uh, nor how to crochet the blanket using the stitch. Once again, if you want to learn how to make the, um, the stitch, you are going to find links to my old tutorial in the description box below the video. Uh, the point of the video is to show you my practice in beginner crocheting as a blind person. In fact, my sister and I are planning to make more videos um, showing you how this is going to go. <laughs> so it is an ongoing project. Once in a while, maybe once a week, or I'm not sure um, how often, um, we will post a video showing you my progress. So wish me luck. And uh, oh, uh, by the way, when um, I told my uh, bioenergy therapist that I'm going to start um, crocheting a blanket, he ordered it from me. Yeah, how lucky I got, right? But um, 
I am sure he was just, uh, you know, nice and uh, he really wants me to do normal things, like... I'm sure you know what normal means, anyway. See, I am really nervous once again, <laughs> because I'm going to start the actual project. <sighs> Wish me luck.